Hi guys, this is Sylvia and today I'm going to show you how you make your report or email or presentation or any other stuff more beautiful by using Snipping Tool. Snipping Tool is a tool that captures some selected area on your screen and makes a snip. And you can place the snip anywhere you want. Let's illustrate it. Let's say that you are making profitability report and you want to illustrate it by some table from Excel file. So, hit the Start button and uh, find all programs and then scroll down to Accessories. Uh, within Accessories there is a snipping tool with this small scissor icon, so just click it and open it. Now, you should select the format of your snip. Well, for your reports and other stuff you'll probably use rectangle format. Then you will select the area that you want to copy to your report. Well, in this case it would be this nice Excel table with sales. Once you have selected it, you see that snip appears here in the separate window. Now it's the time to edit it. Uh, for example, you can highlight what you want. Uh, in this case, probably declining Hubertino sales with highlighter. Or you can even use pen to write something there, to write your note. So as you can see, you can play around a little bit. Once you are done, you go to Edit, Copy, and then you'll just paste it to the report like here. Now that's it. The very big advantage of this approach is that uh, you are not copying the whole Excel file to your report, which would probably cause that your report would be huge in size. Instead, you are pasting just a picture. And as you can see, it's really simple and quick to do. And the same thing works when you want to insert some picture to the PowerPoint presentation or to your email or, or to some other stuff. For example, you want to insert some picture from internet to your PowerPoint presentation. Let's say you want to insert current stock exchange graph to your PowerPoint. So let's go to Bloomberg to internet. And let's say that you want to insert this government bond yield curve to your PowerPoint presentation. So again, just open a snipping tool. And you know what? This time we will select freeform snip just to make it fun and to show you how it works. So now once you selected freeform snip, you have to actually draw the area yourself. It will not be nice rectangle, which you would probably use in reality. So I'll try to use my mouse to draw a nice circle around the graph. Fine, here we go. It's our snip. Now we can highlight some items and again use edit, copy and paste it to your PowerPoint presentation. Sweet, isn't it? In fact, there are countless possibilities how to use snipping tool in your presentations, reports, in your emails. Or if something just simply grabs your attention and you want to quick save it, then just use snipping tool and save the whole screen as a picture. So I hope this is useful tip for you guys and see you next time. Bye.